Welcome to the Peanut Gamer Show, where we share our journey to building a crypto gaming studio and discuss Web3 topics. I'm Joseph, the co-founder of Peanut Games, and today we have our weekly update from the Master of Scrum, Chief Operations Officer of Peanut Games, AC. Welcome to the show, Ace. Thanks for having me, Joseph. Yeah, man. So in case a lot of people don't know, um, like have insights into operations and what it does, I know that, you know, when we started this startup, uh, I didn't really have an idea of what went on in the operations side and seeing you guys create the scrum meetings and doing project management stuff. It was like very new to me. So since this is our first weekly update for peanut games, do you mind giving us like a breakdown of what operations is from a, like a dummy's perspective, someone has no idea, like what's, what's the big picture goal that you guys do? Sure. Yeah, definitely. Um, so operations is a, is a basically a very high level uh, way to describe everything that's moving all the moving parts uh, within an organization. Um, the boots on the ground per se. Um, we have designers, we have developers, we have the project management um, folks. We have all sorts of uh, folks on the boots on the ground that are actually working together as a team to build uh, towards a, a singular goal of, of building out our, 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 our studio and our product. So at the highest level, that's pretty much the, the general summary of what operations is. So I feel like the, the dummy version for me is that you guys ensure that everything runs smoothly, that um, it's clear like what people are doing in a sense and um, that there's like deadline set. Is that also correct, you'd say? Yeah, yeah, you said it more eloquently, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> and, and briefly, and brevity, with brevity. <laughs> I, think, I think the difference is you have a seasoned professional and then you have a guy who's just like, I don't really understand this. <laughs> <It's just laughs> no, me. not, no, you're, 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 <laughs> you're, you got it. <laughs> Super dumbed down version, but um, cool. You know, with that definition, um, it's been really cool just like, making things a lot more organized for everybody and ensuring that like teams are very communicated. And obviously, you know, we're still working on that, but um, it's been a lot better since you've come on and it's a lot more clear for the departments as well. So that's been a really cool thing. And we're, you know, we've been so thankful to have you. Um, but as this is the weekly update, uh, what updates do you got for us, man? Like what's um, some insight into the operations side of peanut games? Yeah, sure. Some some behind the scenes, some behind the curtains, uh, what we have planned and what, what's going on for sure. Um, for for the development side, um, we have a prototype that's built out uh, and we're currently refining on that prototype. Um, our dev team is working to port that prototype's Android version into iOS so that the uh, we can test out um, iOS uh, version of the prototype as well. Um, we're also building out the designs um, for the screens as well as the screen flows themselves and kind of refining that process, refining those flows and designs. Um, and from the art perspective, uh, we're in contact with a few artists. We're gonna bring them on uh, to help design the uh, in-game assets. So in, in general, that's pretty much um, development behind the scenes right now. That's awesome. And today we had a, um, a meeting that it was actually my first time. <laughs> I think that'd be cool to share, but like, it's, it was called a retrospective meeting, and basically each scrum is two weeks. Correct me if I'm wrong, Ace, because I'm the I'm the novice here. But that's right. Each scrum lasts two weeks, and it's basically a time to reflect. Um, and we had all the team members on, which was kind of cool to see. <laughs> I was I had to go first, and so like I was kind of clueless. I was just like, wait, what what am I doing? <laughs> and um, basically, it's the team sharing like what worked, what didn't work, what needs to be discussed. Um, thanking other team members for their help, which is always a cool thing, right? To have your work be appreciated. Um, was this normal in, you know, your like typical business side when you used to do operations as well? I'm just curious. Yeah, yeah, um, it is. It's uh, it's actually, so Scrum is um, a part of how we work at, as developers in, in terms of a development team. Um, it's just another way of saying uh, there's a standardized process that most developers work towards. Um, that's not, I don't want to get into the details of Scrum uh, of Agile versus Waterfall, but um, Scrum is a process in which we follow. And in, in that retrospective that you just referred to is a uh, Scrum ritual um, that we follow uh, on a, on a bi-weekly cadence. Um, now, the sprints can be shorter or longer depending on your, the project's need, but ours is uh, standardized to two weeks. And uh, retrospectives 
occur after each um, sprint. Yeah. You use such big words. Correct me if I'm wrong. I feel like I remember this, but agile is basically a way where things can shift. Like we can change products fast. And waterfall is like a, it has to this in order to go to this. Is that correct? Yeah, water, waterfall is very rigid. It's the old school way of doing development. Um, and Agile allows that flexibility. So if something didn't work during this two week period, we can quickly, uh, you know, switch directions to something else. Yeah. Awesome. I'm, I'm definitely learning things since I have the, the dummy version of it all. <laughs> but, uh, no, you're good. You're good. Yeah. Good, man. But yeah, I thought that that uh, retrospective call we did today um, was really cool. I think Thomas, our community manager, will end up posting that image of all of us and the mirror board was super organized, but like, um, you know, like even in the entrepreneurial world, it was really cool to like meditate and, you know, think through like what we did. And so I feel like the retrospective part, it's exactly that, right? It's reflection and looking back and saying like, where did you mess up? Where could you do better? Where do you need to discuss? And I think that's really important in a business. Um, but that was something that happened today. Uh, for the first time for me, I'm pretty sure it's happened already for you guys. Just First time for me. Um, any other thing that we might have missed that is like an update on the operation side of Peanut Games? Uh, no, generally we're just working towards milestones right now. Um, of course, milestone targets can change, but yeah, those are the current ones that we're working towards for this week and next. That's awesome, man. Well, cool. That's this week's update for the operation side of Peanut Games. If you've stayed to the end, thank you for watching. Make sure you hit the subscribe button, tell your friends, even your grandmother, and thank you guys.